What's going on everybody? It's your boy Trey Sense here. Bringing in another little update. Yes, I'm still at the beach for just another day. I leave coming home tomorrow. Not really looking forward to it. Neither is chaos, but oh well. Okay. Yesterday, my scent of the evening was this little bad boy. And that is Hollister Festive. I'm sorry, Festival Vibes. And you know what? It's a great smelling fragrance. Aquatic, woodsy. A little bit sweet turns into a little bit bubble gummy then goes back to a, a, a masculine woodsy aquatic type of fragrance I like it performance on it was okay it wasn't again uh, a stellar performer but it did I guess about average I want to have to two hours of projection uh, with the first hour being pretty pretty strong and then the next hour kind of telling off a little bit but the first hour was really really strong uh, longevity on it was about four to four and a half hours I could get whiffs of myself and uh, it's a $25 fragrance, um, and that was in a gift set. If you purchased it by itself, you might could find it a little cheaper. I would check eBay. The only thing with eBay is you're not 100% sure of what you're getting, so you have to be careful with that one. And my fragrance of the day today, which is Thursday, the first part of the day, is Sea Salt and Fig by Kindred Goods. And, of course, you know this is sold at Old Navy. And as you know, again, I, I hate to sound redundant, but these fragrances are very light, very fresh, very airy. And you know when you get light, fresh, and airy, that leads to pretty bad performance. But again, if you're familiar with this fragrance, then you already know the price point on it is between $10 and $15 for one fluid ounce or 30 mil. Um, to me, it smells good enough to just reapply it if you need to. I will say I definitely enjoyed wearing them both down here. In this this atmosphere this climate I definitely enjoyed the sea salt and fig um, to me to me they're worth purchasing if you come across them at the right price I don't suggest you overpay um, I say you know get them at the right price and they're, they're good fragrances again neither one of them are going to be performance monsters you're definitely gonna have to reapply but I think they're for the price versus how they smell versus performance I'm okay with it and the scent that I'm going to wear this evening as I will I'm sure we'll get out tonight and get uh, get some some dinner because it is actually our anniversary which is the reason we come down here this time of the year uh, Kels and I have been married four years now so happy anniversary to my beautiful wife love you baby okay this is my scent of the evening John Barbados artisan pure and I cannot wait to get this in the atmosphere um, other John Barbados fragrances have not been the best performers, but the last time I wore this one, it was better. Um, I'm anxious to see what it does down here in this salty heat, and it is hot today. <laughs> As usual, it's in the 90s, and it's, it's, it's hot, muggy, you know, that type of thing. But again, this is my scent of the evening. Oh, there it is. John Barbados Artisan Pure, my scent of the day. Sea salt and fig, trying to get it in there. Sea salt and fig. And it, again, it, you know, did about an hour and a half projection, maybe three hours of longevity. Uh, but it's so small, I take it with me, and I just, I hit myself every chance I get with it. And scent of last night, Hollister Festival Waves. And it did about an hour and a half to two hours of projection with about four and a half hours of longevity. All right, guys, if you have any familiarity with these fragrances, whether it's John Barbados, Sea Salt and Fig, or... Hollister festive waves be sure to leave it in the comment below be sure to like share and subscribe it's Thursday I hope everybody is having a great day and getting ready for the weekend and all that good stuff um, again be sure to like share and subscribe if you have any familiarity with these fragrances let your boy know and I'm gonna jump off here I will let you know tomorrow what this little bad boy did on performance all right guys have a good day peace